Hello and welcome back to episode 19 of Resident Evil Village. I'm Vic and you're watching yet another Let's Play channel. And we have a whole nest of lichens that are going to eat us and I totally overlooked that first aid. Good thing I looked around. Speaking of looking around, okay. So we got no ammo for the shotgun. We got a little bit for the pistol. We're pretty well stacked on the rifle, but this isn't really rifle territory. And I'm going to get literally dogpiled as soon as I hop down here. Oh, it's Krampus! That's not good. Okay, well... Let's go ahead and start with our A game. By getting clobbered. Yeah, that's that's what A game looks like around here. Oof. What is with these guys and their enormous melee weapons? Well, I was hoping he was gonna bust the pillar. So I think that was it for the good stuff. Where even was he? Wow. Alright, you know what? I did just shoot off my mouth about the rifle, but... Like that. That's good leadership. Oh, come on, come on. Get cornered. Good idea. Slow ass shotgun. How did I not get smacked? Not complaining, just wondering. awareness is good. Not getting cornered is good. You know what? Yeah, I got a, I got a couple of magnum rounds. I might as well spend them. Yes! Okay, well that was one good one. Did that ricochet, or did it just go super wild? Oh. Almost did it to myself again. I keep thinking that there's a, a loop that I can run, but I'm on the wrong side of it. I don't need to craft ammo right now. I need to craft health. Yeah, why not? I'll take it. I did take it. Oh, that's what he does with the pillars. How about drop it on yourself, huh? No? Alright, well that's that's acceptable. And again. Every time I do that. <coughs>
and now he's up top. Have a pipe bomb. Yeah, have another pipe bomb. Ooh. I didn't get got. Oh, spin attack. Yeah, up yours. Good achievement name. Eat shit. Well, that's that's kind of rude, Ethan. Okay. What? That wasn't terrible. Chem fluid. Crystal hammer. Why is it stuck in the skull? That's not... No, that's not where I went through when I was running from... Uh... Heisenberg at the beginning. Whoa. What is this about? Is this like the faith? A big dead something? Have I wiped out the warwelves yet? Alright, let's do a quick reorganize. Nope. Good. And, okay. Not combinable, not combinable, nope. Well, I think we're going to get some good money out of all that. I hope the Duke has some more stuff for me to buy soon. There's a TV. Heisenberg is going to talk to me. There's the last piece of my girl. Ooh. What? what? Did You're she just deal, telepathy Ethan. me? Well done. Quit hiding, asshole. I'm not letting you get out of this. <laughs> cool your jets. Just a little bit more, and you're all wrapped up. I'll lend you a hand. So in exchange... In exchange what? First of all, come to me. Put all the flasks in the altar, and I'm sure you'll figure the rest out. See you, Ethan. God damn it. That feels an awful lot like we're headed into the climax, but... Um... We're gonna have to deal with Mother Miranda after we're done with Heisenberg. Why, yes, I will take Guglielmo's plate. Come on, get the boat. Oh yeah, I get to drive. Is there going to be stuff down here for me to grab? There is not.
That looks sort of stuffy though, doesn't it? Just a lamp? Just a lamp. Where is the power plant that's running this stuff? I mean, it doesn't look like there's an extravagant need for power at the moment, but it's obviously some. Is it, is it all coming from those windmills? No, because there were lights on before I moved to the windmills. Well, which way am I supposed to go? So I can go the other way. Locked from the inside. Ethan, come on. Alrighty. As if I'm going to do anything but run straight to the Duke, Duke and sell stuff right now. Oh, but this is where I'm supposed to go because that's where I'm supposed to put the flasks. It's my greatest pleasure to see you return alive. If it's just looking, window shop away. I am I'm not just looking. I'm I'm selling you stuff. I don't know why you want this stuff. I mean, like quartz, what's the big deal? Okay. Dissatisfied? I believe this is a fair price. I'm only dissatisfied because you don't have new stuff to sell me. Or new upgrades to put on my this guns. This is all an investment. Mr. The Duke. Do let me know if you find anything else of value. You're letting me down here, man. Okay, so I'm supposed to do that. But I really don't want to get sucked into an end game Yet. I mean, it's pretty unlikely that it actually is going to be an endgame because there's so much stuff that I haven't upgraded yet. And it seems likely that there's another round of improved... Uh... What? Hmm. Another round of improved weapons for me to grab. Okay, so... I have this idea that somewhere around here there is a drawbridge. That's a drawbridge, but I don't think I can get that one down again. But somewhere there's a drawbridge I can lower with the crank. Maybe not. Alright, well, let's go check out that other path leaving, leading out from, from Heisenberg's place. Apparently that was the Heisenberg thing. He's marked as defeated now. Except he's probably going to try and take all the flasks from me when I go see him. That's probably the way this is going to go down. Ethan, thank you. Phantom fish. I do believe that's where I left the boat. Kadu implantation notes. Subjects 174 through 181. Subject 174. Characteristics 21. Male. Silversmith. Scars from pneumonia. Results. Low affinity. 
Kadu failed to grow. Body transformation, drop in cognition, another lichen, sent to pasture. Subject 177, characteristics 21, female, no occupation, no history of illness. Results, death. Subject 181, Alcina D. D for Dimitrescu. Characteristics 44, female, noble descendant, not from the village, hereditary blood disease. Results very high affinity, no loss of cognition, arbitrarily able to control body transformation, applied cognition control procedure, sent for observation. So there appears to be a correlation between history of disease and suitability for implantation with these Kadu. Oh, well, I figured you'd show up. Takers. Okay. All right. Well, good thing I came back and checked that out. We learned some good stuff there. So about that phantom fish, that is not where the boat is parked, and it's not where I picked up the boat either. We were underground the whole way. So there's another boat somewhere over by Cannibal Boy's place. There was water there, but I just walked through that water. Let's try it. Yeah, let's try that. Do you think Heisenberg is going to transform? I mean, he's already got some kind of magnetic superpowers. What more does he really need? Not that one. This one. I guess I'm going a little roundabout. Is it this way? Yeah. It's starting to feel very empty around here. I wonder if I actually genocided the lichens. This isn't the right way, is it? No, it isn't. No, the cannibal guy wasn't over in Moreau's place. He was on the way to the stronghold. That's right. Good thing Heisenberg made it easy to find our way back there.
This way, daddy. And how exactly did this tiny ass village supply so many people as fodder to these experiments? And still have some left over to be slaughtered? Yeah, that's the water, but there's no boat here. Well, where else have I found boats? I found boats at Moreau's place, but I can't get there anymore because of the elevator not working, right? Pretty sure. Nothing up there, right? No. It's just a pretty straight jaunt through that gauntlet. Why exactly am I hung up on a single fish? I mean... I have already missed out on a bunch of food on account of the Baron. The Duke. The Duke. Being dishonest with me. It's been a while since we were back this way. Is there possibly a boat back here? Oh hey! The drawbridge and the crank! Excellent. There's the boat, but I think... I think I probably need to take it to... the other end of the route. So let's see what's upstream, I guess. Some rotten bridges overhead. Well, now that's interesting. That might be right for a phantom fish. How far off course am I right now? Well, I'm not doing what Heisenberg told me to do, so I ought to be in good shape, right? Oh, we're back here. And I believe there is a well back here. Yeah. Well wheel. This might be the very last time we need the well wheel. Oh. That's not what I expected to find. YOLO. I wouldn't mind having some more shotgun ammo, climbing down into a mysterious well. That's a long ladder, too. It's icky in here.
What an interesting place. <coughs> Locked from the other side. Okay, so I guess we gotta do a little puzzle here. A little platforming in a game where you can't actually jump. Interesting. So what does that do for me? I can push this. Uh, buddy. Can't climb up on it. In this, can I get that other one off of there? Maybe. Okay. And then... Do any good at all? Wow, these buttons. It's a good thing there isn't a time pressure for this. Aha, okay. And large pigeon blood ruby. I believe that that's going to go. Yeah. So what's that called now? Dimitrescu's necklace. Oh, Duke's going to be stoked about that. Don't like that. But we're done in there anyway. Still haven't found that fish. is this? Uh-oh. 
Can I? Okay, good. Um, well, you know what? We are out of time for episode 19. So come back and see me again in episode 20 for whatever this is going to turn out to be. We've done these swinging torch puzzles a couple of times now. Um, I don't think we're supposed to be here yet, so we might not get very far. But if not, we'll go play with Heisenberg. Talk to you then.